I saw brand new. What's going on, guys? We're here at Riff, Riff Los Angeles. Uh, decided to come through today. Gonna see what they got. They've always got some good stuff at great prices. Um, already found a couple stuff. Jason's actually grabbing those for me, but yeah, we'll take you guys along, kind of show you guys the selection they have here, and let's see what we can cop. All right, so I actually see something, which, you know, I mean, shoes come and go, but one shoe I definitely regret letting go of are these, the Kassen SB Midnight Navy One Lows. I think I bought them back then off of Stock X for like 160. I wore the hell out of them, but then I ended up selling them just because the prices jumped up on them a lot. This one is, <laughs> this is my size. It's the black cat of the Jordan one. It's uh, size nine for, they're going for 750 now, so. Um, yeah, great shoe though. Just can't really find them anymore. Check out all the the baby 85s on display. We got a dead stock Supreme black cement. We got a Manila four. We got the baby bear pack. We got a cause display over here. Um, but yeah, shouts to Ed and Jason. They actually bought a piece of that out for us to show you guys. We got a friends and family pair of the fragment ones. This has the black stamp on it. Not only do they have these, they actually, I don't know if you guys remember the story on these, but um, yeah, pairs actually hit Marshalls. So this actually was purchased at Marshalls, even still has a tag on it and then the receipt is available. So crazy come up to whoever found these at Marshalls, but I remember seeing, there was actually a decent amount of pairs actually hit Marshalls. So. But yeah, we got two iterations of it. We got the, uh, the friends and family and then the release version. Of course they would. They actually have the wear tester pair. Um, this is a Marjar 2.5. This has a black toe cap. So the only people that actually have these are actually people who are actually participating in the wear testing program on these. It's funny because I actually wore my 2.0 today. But yeah, insanely rare to get. These are so fire. What do you think, Isaac? Cop. Cop? Yeah. For retail. You, you missed out on the 2.0 pair. Yeah. Uh, this is actually another cool one. This is actually Michael Jordan's daughter's pair. Uh, I don't know the exact significance behind these, but just kind of a cool green with the crocodile midsole and then on the uppers as well. And check these out. 
So there's been a lot of buzz actually, what, today? It's been today? This week. This week, there's a lot of buzz on these today. These are actually the cause. Jordan 1 Lowe's. Uh, just like a swooshless one. Um, I have the regular release pink pair that I wear pretty often. Quality is really good on it. It's got the X's on the inside. So, but Riff actually has a pair here. This one's from, I think 2016. This is a, a, a promo pair, so crazy. All right, so we got a lot of lobster talk going on right now with the orange ones. I actually just picked up the special box orange pair, so I'm pretty excited to get those in. I'm actually gonna grab these today. We got a pair of the red lobsters. First colorway to drop. Contemplating on these ones. I actually have the green. The green's actually, I slept on these hard. I actually got a pair back then, ended up selling it, but the green goes hard. What you think, Isaac? Cop. Cop. Yeah, I'm gonna grab these two. Wait, these are a little used, but I'll probably clean them up. Got a Marty McFly SB. They also have a ton of the Supreme pairs. Shout out to all the OG SB guys. Got the newer ones as well. Ooh, Supreme Blazers. Man. Bricks. <laughs> what the the recent iteration of the recent drops, obviously those aren't doing too well, but I mean, you know, we got the Gucci hit on the back. These are so nice. The red pair is the, red pair is the best, followed by the white and then the black in my opinion. Got a, a dead stock pair of puffin stuffs. Ooh, Aloha's. Brand new with box, crazy. Uh, Isaac, how do you feel about the orange pair? I love them. You love them? Don't need them though. Don't need them, but definitely a good pair. They have a size 10 and a half and a size seven as well. Wait, what'd you say? Hmm? What'd you say? Uh, one of my idols has this shoe. What shoe does he have? The Bisons. One of my idols has it, so I kind of want to cop them. Should we say the name of your idol? No, let them guess. Let them guess. I happen to have a pair of Bisons. Am I your idol? It's not you. It's not me. Isaac, question for you. It's good. We're looking at these three displays here. Okay. If you had to pick a shoe, which shoe would it be? What would Isaac's choice be? Am I wearing it? Um, I mean, yeah, I, I would say pick something that you would wear. But if you had the options. I mean, we got OGs on top. I'm not gonna wear those though. That's what I'm saying. We got Kobe's. We already have those. I'm not gonna wear an OG. All right, what you feeling, Isaac? What's the question? One shoe from their display. Um, just one shoe that stands out to you that you look up. You're going with the Kobe 2s? I know you like the, what's it called? The Del Sol pair, right? The Carpe Diems. Oh, the Carpe Diems? Yeah. I'd pick a 2. Dang. Most underrated Kobe model? The 2s? Uh, best Kobe model. Best Kobe model. Best Kobe model. Wow. I size. disagree. Because you're a hater. That's why. I'm not a hater. I'm just saying it's not the best. You can't you can't say those are better than the fours or the or the eights or the nines or you the elevens. Know that this has significant sentimental value to me, so that's why it's the best Kobe. Okay. Fair enough. So is that the shoe you're going with? Yeah, for sure. Easy. There we go. Yo, these are actually kind of fire, but it's actually a golf shoe, but. Colorway is actually really cool. How much are those? These are free. They're free. 
There's no price on it. That means it's free, right? Yep. That's what I heard. Let's do it. Add them to the tab. Dang, you're buying a lot, Jimmy. You know. Any day, Isaac. Um, these Grinches? We'll try to get this tape done, but then I'll have it. What's on the bottom? On the bottom. The bottom of that stack. The bottom of that stack. It's a special box. Looks like we got a special box? Yeah, a special box. A 720 with a special box. Yeah, whoa. It's got a special smell. <laughs> Exclusives. Did y'all sell those 20? You in line claiming your free shoes? It says these are free and no price, so. No price, free shoes. That's what's up, guys. We just came through Riff. Thank you guys so much. Thanks to Ed and Jason. Always taking care of us, always blessing us. I think we picked up about seven, eight pairs, uh, which you guys saw. So, uh, yeah, if you guys are ever in LA, definitely come check them out. They're in Little Tokyo. Great people, great shop. They'll definitely take care of y'all.